in this video we will look at the print merge feature of Corel Draw. So I have created the layout here for name badges that I will be engraving. My size of the name badge will be three by one and a half. So that is the canvas size that I have created. The outline is a red hairline because of course my name badges will be cut out of the material that I will be using. I've inserted information that will be on every single name badge the exact same. The logo, the tagline, and the URL for the website. What will be dropped in the middle area here will be each person's name and their title. I have inserted that information into Excel and I saved it as a CSV file. So I inserted name and title as the field names and then each person's name and each person's title. When I saved it, I went to File, Save As, and for file type, it needs to be a comma delimited file, which is called a CSV. So here's all the information. This file must be closed in order for it to be imported into Corel Draw. So now that I have the layout, I'll go to File, Print Merge, create or load merge fields. I'm not going to be creating new text because I already have created in my CSV file. So I'll import the text. Next, I will locate the file. I'll go to comma separated file or CSV. I'll get my file. I'll click on next. Now here it is showing me the field names that were present in my document and those are correct. Then it shows me all of my information. Next and then finish. Now I have the print merge toolbar available in front of me. So the first field it is displaying, it says name and that is the, my first field so I'll insert it. It inserts it anywhere. I would like to change a few things. Then I'll insert my next field by clicking Title and Insert. Now that the fields are inserted, it is important to center them. So I'll click on the first item, I will center it, and I'll do that for the second field. The reason being is that if I do not, all of the imported text will come in left aligned to this item rather than centered across my item. So now I will go to Merge to Document. All of the information comes in, you can see over here in the Object Manager. Of course right now it, it is just displaying one item. So I'll go to File, Print, and I have a display over here. If your display is not showing, you can click these double arrows and it will display for you. I go into print preview and I tell it how many items I would like it to show. So I'll go over here to the accordion looking button and right now it's only going to print one item but now I can tell it how many columns and rows. So I would like to print five across with three rows and that represents all 15 of my name tags. To get a preview of this I can go over here to the left and click on the pointer tool and now it is displaying all 15 of my cards. Then I can send this to my laser and have all of my cards cut out of the substrate of my choice. And this has been using the print merge feature in Draw. For more information or to sign up for your free trial visit laseru.com